You guys turn around. Look what I did. What? No. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Hello, fellas. Are you back ready for some more abuse here? Of course. Of course. Yeah. Of course. And, and I am who? Jake Wizard 4. Jake Wizard 4 here at Faraday Studio. Hey, what, are you, what position are you going to play in football this year? Uh, hopefully either middle linebacker or running back. Okay. And what are you going to be doing this year? I'm in school for yeah. pre-science and physical therapy. Oh, really? You're going to go with the medical route. Mm -hmm. I'm proud of you, man. I want to see if you can think like a scientist. We're going to do a simple activity. As a matter of fact, the activity that we're going to do is the first one I did, and I think I was eight years old. I learned some science from this. I learned how to think like a scientist from a potato and some straws. I want you to pick up your potato. Let's do it this way. Pick up your potato. Can you push your finger through that potato? Me. Yeah. <laughs> so, watch and learn. We're, we're watch and learn. There it goes. There, come on, get that finger through there. I think I my feel, finger's gonna break. Think your finger, it ain't gonna happen. It's nah. just not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. So I want you guys to just turn and look away from me. So don't, don't be watching. Watch this, watch this. You guys turn around. Look what I did. What? No. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> the old man did that right there. I think he did that. I want you guys to try it. Get your straw through the potato. Okay. Hmm. Come on, everybody's watching you now. Just get the straw through the potato, guys. Yeah. All right. You want to watch the master? Sure. Let's see so what it is. This is I feel this I've got to see. One, two, three. Okay, yeah, look at that. I didn't go through that time, but I went halfway through that time. Hey, Beckett, are you back there? Would you bring your potato out here? Um, was that difficult for you, young man? A little bit, actually. Actually, hey, a little uh, bit, but you figured it hey. out. Yeah. I'm gonna need to borrow that potato. <laughs> I'm gonna need them to cut the cameras, and then we gonna be like, that's <laughs> okay, my potato. That's so I want to see how close what? you can get to, to 11 year old Beckett's potato. Come on, go for it. Oh, look at that. Okay. <laughs> Bam. There you go. Look at that, that's pretty good. There, there you, you go. go. <laughs> Finally. So did you notice what you did? What made it start to work? What's he doing now? Applying more force to more a force. smaller part. To, to, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, he's get, trying to get it go faster. More velocity. More velocity. Because when you study physics, you learn about uh, conservation and momentum. You see, I'm a football player. What's yeah, yeah. physics? I'm going to pick something up. I'm going to set it here. And I want you to look at it and say, what does this have to do with that? Ta-da. Did he just pick up a shovel? So you say they have something in common, right? Yeah, they, they both go on the ground, right? They both go on the ground. Hey, Beckett's got one. Their what? potatoes go on the ground, shovels go on the ground. The straw is going to be sharper than the potato. Well, that's sharper than the potato. Are you sharper than the potato? Well, I'd like to say that I'm just a little bit. Just like we have to apply a certain amount of force in order to break through the outer layer of the potato with the straw, the same thing could be said for a shovel. You have to apply a certain amount of pressure in order to break the ground. Just like when you have to stomp on it. Yeah, you stomp on a shovel, you know, put a couple hundred pounds on there. Yeah. But it kind of concentrates all of the force you're applying to a small area. Mm -hmm. So almost the edge of that straw. How much can you press? When you're I pressing? can bench press 395 pounds. 395 pounds. So when you're pushing that straw, about how hard do you think that is? You know what 395 feels like? What do you? What do you think you're doing? Uh, probably at the minimum, 15. 15 pounds? We could calculate the surface area of the end of that straw and then take the number of pounds. And you'll find out that it's thousands of pounds per square inch that this is concentrating. That's why it's going through the potato system. Hmm. Ah, <laughs> beautiful, that's smooth. No Smoother. wonder you're not a quarterback. No wonder you're not a quarterback. <laughs> what is it? I finally got my finger through the potato. <laughs> Sweet, man, that's very good. Got to think outside of the potato. That's what I'm saying, <laughs> outside of the potato. Hey, Beckett, you see the book? Yep. yep. The Wizard's Book of Science Secrets? By Wizard 4. By Wizard 4, and look yep. here on page 43, what do you see? I see a potato. You see a potato. You see this straws. with a whole bunch of straws through yep. it. So if you want to do more activities like this, you can get your hands on a whole series of books and look in the video description, you can see how to order these. We got to get your picture in here. Straws through monkey. <laughs>